Okay, I'm just recording a little bit of the um, work that I'm doing on this uh, chess uh, table, small chess table. Um, as you can see, um, I've stripped out the words. They had a, like a paper lining inside. That's been stripped out. Uh, need a little bit more work, a bit more sanding. I've done most of the of the repairs, the filling and repairs, gluing back, that kind of work. Um, I've taken these little dividers off. Um, they um, they will sit um, they will sit in there uh, to, to to divide off this section here for the chess pieces. Um, so I need to clean those up. Um, they they'll be glued back into position. Yeah, sort of. As you can see, they go there. And then I need to reline the interior of this. I've got some. This was what was this was, uh, was what was in there before. Uh, it's not it's not very nice. I've got some nice wallpaper here which I think will do the job. So I need to get on with that. Hopefully that shouldn't take too long. I can leave that to, to dry overnight. And then I can re, uh, re color the outside of the unit. Uh, we've got the legs here. Um, it all needs to be re, as you can see, or recolored. Um, and re, re polished. Uh, but I want to do a little video of, of showing just how I reline the interior um, of this piece of furniture. The first job is to uh, remove all the rest of this paper. I've refurbished it. Um, it's all been filled and um, we recolored and it's had a first coat of lacquer. Um, what I'm going to do is to uh, line the inside of this with this wallpaper. Um, line the through here and around the edge, and then I've got these spaces, which I'm also uh, going to cover with the. With this wallpaper um, and then they'll they'll sit around around here you'll see that later when I do it that that will be later that will be glued on onto there um, to it's just a spacer to create a, um, a pocket area around here so I'm gonna get on with that I'll show you how I do that I'm just going to use this is just ordinary wallpaper it's, it's a very tough one though a washable wallpaper so it's, it's got a coating on it so it'll be nice and tough and it can be cleaned just going to use ordinary pre-mixed wallpaper adhesive to fix it on there strong and a nice strong one um, so I'll show you I'll show you how I do that
Okay, that can be left to dry. Okay, I'm about to dry off for a little bit and I can run some more round li line around the edge here and I can cut, cut the hole out.
Okay, this is all nice and dry now. I've got the latch back in. Um, this is shaped, put that in its shape and glued it together. So that's ready to, to glue on in place now. And then once that's glued in place, um, I shall give all this a, a wax all the way around and um, pop the hinges back on. Okay, that's good. As you can see, it's fixed on now. We've got the partition around here for the chest pieces. So I shall let that go off for 10 minutes or so, have a tidy up, and then oh, I can refix the lid. That way around that goes. Um, needs a little bit more colouring the lid just to make sure it's the same colour as the base. Uh, so a little bit of colouring on the top and then that can be waxed and that should work quite nicely.